What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to show you how to calculate 1.01 to the power of 4 and 1.01 to the power of 5 using binomial expansion. So, the first one is 1.01 to the power of 4, I need to expand it. I'm gonna write 1.01 as 1 plus 0.01 to the power of 4. So when you expand it, it's gonna be 4c0, 1 to the power of 4, 0.01 to the power of 0 plus 4c1 1, 1 to the power of 3 0.01 to the power of 1 plus 4c2 1 to the power of 2 0.01 to the power of 2 plus 4c3 1 to the power of 1 0.01 to the power of 3 and finally 4c4 1 to the power of 0 0.01 to the power of 4 so what we have here, then these numbers, this one is 1, 4, 6, 4, 1. So when you evaluate it, this 1.01 to the power of 0 is 1. So 1 to the power of 4 is 1. So the first one is just 1 plus 4 times 1 times 0.01. Next one is 6 times 1 times 0.01, which is 0 0.0001 plus this one is going to be 4 times 1, 4 times 1 times 10 to the power of negative 6 plus this one is also 1 times 1 times 10 to the power of negative 2 to the power of 4 which is negative 8. So it's going to be 1 plus 0.04 plus 0 0.0006 plus 4 times 10 to the power of negative 6 plus 1 times 10 to the power of negative 8. That's going to make it as 1.04060401. That's going to be the expansion. We can also double check it with the calculator. 1.01 to the power of 4. That's going to be 1.04060401. Perfect. Now let's look at the 1.01 to the power of 5. So that's going to be 1 plus 0 0.01 to the power of 5, which is 5C0, 1 to the power of 5, 0 0.01 to the power of 0, plus 5C1, 1 to the power of 4, 0 0.01 to the power of 1, plus 5C2, 1 to the power of 3, 0 0.01 to the power of 2. Then you have 5C3. 1 to the power of 2, 0.01 to the power of 3, 5c4, 1 to the power of 1, 0.01 to the power of 4, plus 5c5, 1 to the power of 0, 0.01 to the power of 5. So that's going to be, this one is 1, 5, 10, 10, 5, 1. So 1 times 1 plus 5 times 0 0.01 plus 10 times 10 to the power of negative 4 plus 10 times 10 to the power of negative 6 plus 5 times 10 to the power of negative 8 and finally 1 times 10 to the power of negative 10 which is going to be 1.050 that's actually is going to be 1 0 1 O five O one. So that's how we expanded. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any question. Thank you for watching and have a great day.